Hello everyone, my name is Treg. You're watching The Analog Explorer. So today we are shooting with a Kodak Signet 50. It's a pretty cool little uh, viewfinder, 35 millimeter from 1957. Nice thing about this camera is that it's got a selenium light meter that, at least on mine, still appears to function correctly. Another nice feature of this camera is the aperture and shutter speed rings are tied together so that when you turn one, it turns the other at the same time. You keep the same exposure value. Uh, one thing about this camera is that the lens is 30% thorium oxide, making this a radioactive camera. The film today is Astrum Color 125. It's an interesting Russian film that we've been getting in America and it's been giving people some interesting results, so I'm excited to see what we shoot today. We're on Savi Island today. When Lewis and Clark passed by this place on their trip upstream, they called it Wapato Island, named after the edible root that the Multnomah tribe was harvesting. The Multnomahs lived here in a great village until the fever and ague of 1829 wiped them out. Years later, a fur trading outpost called Fort William was established by Nathaniel Wyeth. I think this place was once a dairy. There's still some cows grazing around though. Always had tremendous respect for farmers. This is the next building we're gonna to explore today. Looks like it's the barn. Uh, I have a feeling that we're gonna to have to watch out for rusty nails in this one. Let's go check it out. There's like a dog or something outside. Probably just gotta wait it out, you know? That'll be all right. This whole thing, you know, taking photos in these kinds of places, not the safest, you know, but sometimes it just, uh, you know, I'm willing to do what I have to to stay safe. Minor hang up resolved itself. Let's go. I think I see a house through the trees over here. Um, it's really beautiful in this area. There's a lot of wildflowers, but we're gonna go check that out now. This house looks pretty uh, unsteady. 
Probably safer if I just go alone. Fort William was actually the site of the first murder case in Oregon. There were uh, two men named Thornburg and Hubbard, and they'd had a fight over a Native American girl named Mary. And Thornburg was the drunk of the fort. And one night he entered Hubbard's cabin, armed, ready to fire. But Hubbard was actually prepared as he was the gunsmith of the island. <laughs> Eventually, the homicide was ruled as justifiable. Just goes to show you what life was like before there was any kind of provisional government in this area. Well done. Okay, great day for exploring. Very cool location. Let's go get our stuff back to the lab. Thank you for watching my video on the abandoned dairy at Oak Island. If you want to find out more about this place, you can visit the Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife at Savi Island. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel as well as follow me on Instagram. I'll see you next time on the Analog Explorer.